We've been through a couple of weeks where we've talked to a lot of different people about the head coaching job here at Jim's Basketball. And uh, it was apparent right in the first few minutes of the interview with Tony Barbee that uh, he was the right guy for all of us. Auburn Athletics is about winning championships. That is the reason why, as I look at Auburn University and its men's basketball program, it is my responsibility to live up to that bar that has been raised by all the athletic programs at this great university. When you talk about the great players, Great teams, great coaches, Sonny Smith, 1986 team, one, one game away from a Final Four. When you, when you talk about that, when you talk about the list of great players from, from Chuck Person to Wesley Person to obviously Charles Parker, this, there is a, there is a precedent that has been set within this men's basketball program that it's been done before. And when you look at Auburn Arena, why can't it be done again? And that's why I'm here. That's why I'm here. We are going to go after and we are going to attract the best players in the country. The best. That fit with me, that fit with Auburn University, with fit with the Auburn family and what it stands for. But we're not going to be afraid to go after the best players in this state of Alabama. We're not going to be afraid to go after the best players in the Southeast region. And we are not going to be able to be afraid to go after the best players anywhere in the country. I'll promise you that. There hasn't been a major decision that I've made in my life, personally and professionally, since I've known Coach Cal, that I have not seeked his advice. So obviously, as successful as he, as he has been, um, I wouldn't be very smart if I, if I didn't do that. And um, he knows what a special place Auburn University is. And the advice he gave me as I was going through the process, if you can get the Auburn job, you run it. You run there, so that tells you what what his affection is for this place, and uh, it was for me very quickly learned why he understood the potential of this program. My style is based around one word: that's pressure. We're going to apply pressure to the, our opposing teams for 40 minutes, starting on the defensive end of the floor. That's where you that's where you win and compete for championships on the defensive end of the floor. I believe in a man-to-man, -man, hard nose, in your face, 40 minutes, full court selectively when you can. And I want to create a lot of our offense off of our defense. We'll play an up-tempo style that's fun and exciting for the team to play, fun and exci exciting for the fans to watch, but it's not helping skeleton. It's not running gun. There's a discipline that you have to have to play at a pace that I want to play at. While limiting your turnovers, limiting your turnovers, you have to be disciplined. And at the same time, any good coach is going to base his style around the personnel that he has at the time. And that's part of the evaluation process that I'm going to have to go through initially to figure out if we can employ this style immediately or is it going to take time to build. But those, that's part of the process that I'll have to go through. I'm going to make the, the students a part of this program, just like I'm going to make this community a part of this program. And that love affair has to be rekindled, and that's my job. And the support that we get here is my responsibility. And it's my responsibility to make sure that the fans, this is a challenge. I'm challenging our, our fan base. I'm challenging our students. We need you. You are a part of this program. You're not separate from it. You are a part of it. You make a direct, you have a direct impact on the outcome of games in this, this arena. And I need each and every one of you there 
every night. Because, like I said, there's not going to be a harder working coach, a harder working staff, or a harder group of young men that are going to do it the right way. With class, with integrity, with passion, with heart, with desire. But it's my job to get the students engaged. How you do that, we're going to make it a part of this program.